and welcome to Habits to Happiness. I'm Carolee Greer. And in this video, I'm going to talk about actually how do you build a habit? Because I keep talking about you can choose to be happier, but how do you actually do that? I've been reading books over the years on, on habit building and my own life's journey on self-development and people like James Clear that wrote Atomic Habits. He really, really says there's like four different steps in, in building a habit. Number one is just noticing. What do you want to change? And the second one is want. You need to want to change it. If you really don't want to do it, it's never going to happen. So you do have to choose that you do want to make this difference in your life. And number three is actually doing it. Um, take the action. And number four really resonates with me too, because if you really want to make a new habit that benefits you, it's really helpful if it's something that you like to do, whether that's in your job or something in your own, your own personal life is you want to have some enjoyment in that new habit. And another person that I really resonate with is um, John Acuff. He talks about, his book is Start, and he's got multiple books. Another one is Do Over. And again, he really says you need to not worry about the end goal so much, um, because then we oftentimes don't make a start. And he really talks about achieving your goals and be successful as you do need to start, which is taking action. And Mel Robbins, she, I just love the way she has her five second rule and uh, she just counts down from five, five, four, three, two, one. And then intuitively we want to go, go or blast off. And, and again, it's taking actions. A lot of us rely on willpower to make a change and willpower helps to some extent, but our brain gets fatigued and always trying to make these decisions. And oftentimes we'll, choose to do what we're familiar with and and our willpower doesn't get us all the way. So a way to take action that's beneficial so we can be successful is to make it easier for us. So if you want to drink more water, fill up two or three water bottles in the, in, in the morning and put them on your desk so they're right there and easy to drink so you don't have to get up and get another cup of coffee. Or if you want to start exercising every morning, um, I know that uh, James Clear used to sleep in his exercise clothes so that he didn't have to do that extra step when he got up until it became a habit. For a habit to build, you know, you've heard of 21 days or 66 days. And I really believe, again, what James Clear says, if it's an easier habit, it doesn't take as long. If it's a difficult habit, it's going to take longer. So what we really need to be doing is be consistent and get it into a routine. So if this resonates with you and you're thinking about changing a habit, try to make it a little bit easier to do um, and also be something that gives you a little, some fulfillment at the end and something that you like doing so you will, will actually follow through. And with me, I've been procrastinating these last few weeks because I'm a little bit tired of the pandemic and being at home even though I have a home business um, and Vancouver is beautiful, I can get out and about. I'm still totally following all the restrictions, but it is feeling restrictive. So it's just getting me down a little bit. So I haven't been as happy as what I usually like to be or as positive. So again, it's my choice um, to recognize, to notice that I want to get back to being more positive again. And that's my mindset. So habit to happiness is a mindset and it's a choice and it is a habit. So. I can absolutely uh, change my mindset to, hey, I'm gonna wake up, be more positive, get my to-do list done, take it off, you get a little dopamine um, shot there and feel a little bit happier. So those are all really important things to get into your day-to-day -day routine. So if this resonates with you, um, subscribe to my channel and we'll talk again. This is Carolee Greer and Habits to Happiness.